138 a pound. Fresh green peanuts, only $1.28 a pound. And large seeded or seedless watermelons, three ninety eight each. Piggly Wiggly has boneless ribeye steaks for six ninety eight a pound and center cut pork chops a low dollar ninety eight a pound. Go online to thepig.net for all of the pig specials. Piggly Wiggly, West Cherry Street in Jessup. The Wayne County Chamber of Commerce would like to say congratulations to Parker Insurance and Realty for being voted Business of the Quarter for June. Thank you to Glenna Eubank, Bill Parker, and staff for your support to the Wayne County Community and Chamber since opening in 1977. Again, congratulations to Parker Insurance and Realty for being voted Business of the Quarter for June for the Wayne County Chamber of Commerce. Summer's here. Are you ready? At First Franklin Financial, we can help make this your best summer ever. Spruce up that old car, make your home shine, or take that family vacation you've always dreamed about. Whatever you've dreamed about, we can help make it happen with loans for any need, large or small. Just stop by and see the friendly Franklin folks at 1074 North Macon Street. We're located in the plaza next to Walmart, or give us a call at 912-427-4237, 427-4237, that's 427-4237. Apply online at www.1ffc.com. All loans are subject to our liberal credit policy and limitations, if any. First Franklin Financial Corporation, NMLSR number 141654. Georgia Residential Mortgage License Number 5656. Great products, low prices, helpful service. That's Harris Ace Hardware. Harris Ace is your place for Yeti coolers, Traeger grills, Costa Demar sunglasses, Calcutta Renegade coolers, plus Harris Ace is your hometown dealer for yellow wood treated lumber. Harris Ace will not be undersold on price, so you know you're getting the best price at Harris Ace. Your favorite place for hardware and lumber supplies is Harris Ace Hardware, West Cherry Street in Jessup. Morton Collision is located at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton's offers free estimates, 23-hour towing, and they guarantee their work. Call 427-3769 or after hours, 912-294-6140. The staff at Morton Collision Center works with all insurance companies. So for guaranteed work with a qualified staff, go to Morton Collision at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton Collision, quality you can see. Local news on WIFO. It's time now for a look at latest on local news in the news. Week one of early voting in Wayne County concluded Friday. That leaves two more weeks left to vote in the runoff elections. Vote total after week one, just 130 votes total on Friday. 47 people cast their votes. It's a very low turnout thus far. Everyone, including the candidates, running, hoping the turnout picks up the next two weeks. But at this pace, less than 1,000 registered voters in Wayne County may actually take the time to vote in the Tuesday, July 24th runoff. Locally, one race, and that is the District 3 Commission seat between Incumbent Mike Roberts and challenger Farrell Cooksey, a couple of key runoffs statewide. GOP nomination for governor on the line between Casey Cagle and Brian Kemp. All polls statewide show this is a toss-up at this point with a low turnout statewide. When we'll battle with Democratic candidate Stacey Abrams in November. Once again, early voting this week and next week, no Saturday early voting. Registrar's office located inside the downtown courthouse. The office is open Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. And they're open during lunch for your convenience. If you did not vote in the primary, you're eligible to vote in this runoff election. If you did vote in the primary and voted a party, you must vote that party in the runoff. So if you vote a Republican in the primary, you cannot vote Democratic in the runoff. You must vote Republican in the primary. Same if you vote a Democratic in the date of the election, Tuesday, July 24th. Latest polling in the GOP race showed that it is neck and neck between Casey Cagle and Brian Kemp. Again, Cagle and his allies have poured $2.5 million into TV advertising looking to boost his campaign and attack his rival. Kemp has spent nearly $1 million and recently unveiled his first ad declaring himself a hardcore Trump conservative. Polling also shows that Cagle has a three-point edge over Kemp among men. While women are evenly split, Cagle leads Kemp by double digits with voters over the age of 70, while Kemp dominates among younger women. Polling shows that low turnout favors Kemp, a high turnout would favor Cagle. Two men evenly tied in the Atlanta area, but Cagle has a 10-point lead in the Macon market. Again, hitting into the final two weeks, neck and neck. 
Both men attempted to encourage their supporters to take the time to vote. Turnout thus far across the state, like Wayne County, very low. Change in plans for Brian Kemp this Friday. He'll be calling in on the world-famous Butch and Bob show as Georgia Public TV is scheduled a taping of the debate between he and Casey Cagle for that day in Atlanta. So his trip to Jessup and Wayne County had to be delayed. His bus tour will still be arriving at the depot on Friday at 8 a.m., but Kemp unfortunately cannot make the trip. Again, he'll be calling in live Friday morning on the World Famous Butch and Bob Show, and he'll bring you his comments this Friday here on the World Famous Butch and Bob Show. We'll be back with more news after this word from our sponsor, other commercial messages, so please stay tuned. Folks, Lee Merida, General Manager at Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC in Jessup, home of the No Hassle Deal. We've got some smoking hot deals going on right now through July the 9th, like 20% off Chevy Cruze, Sonic, Spark, and Impala. Get 19% off on select 1500 Series Chevrolet Silverados. Get 11% off all Heavy Duty Silverados. And get 10% off on all Chevy Suburbans and Tahos. Amazing. Looking for a GMC? Get 17% off on GMC Terrain Denali's. Get 10% off on GMC Sierra Heavy Duty Trucks. And get 10% off on GMC Yukon and Yukon XL. And if Buick is more your style, we've got Buick Encores for 18% off. And 0% financing for 72 months on Buick Enclaves. Wow. Hey, this is Spanky. Nobody sells used cars for less than us here at Neesmith and Jessup. So come on in for your no-hassle deal. New or used, nobody will be our no-hassle deals at Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC. Just up the road in Jessup or online at neesmithjessup.com. Chevy, find new roads. There's no place like home. CHSGA Home Health provides the health care you need in the comfort of your own home. CHSGA Home Health is your local nonprofit home health provider with offices in Jessup, Vidalia, Albany, and Watkinsville. CHSGA Home Health offers on call services 24 7, customized care plans for physical, occupational, and speech therapy, even IV medication therapy and wound care in the comfort of your own home. CHSGA Home Health is here if you or a loved one need nursing services or just a little help to get back to living life to the fullest after surgery or an illness. We have many more services available to help you on the pathway to recovery. CHSGA Home Health, your local home health provider. Call us today at 912-916-9795. That's 912-916-9795 because there's no place like home. Wayne County Commissioner is set to meet tonight at 7 p.m. Again, they did not meet this past Monday due to the July 4th holiday. Under citizens' concerns for Kel Scott regarding transportation for Wayne County citizens and Mike Moore to talk about county-owned property. Under new business, consider an approved amendment to animal control ordinance, which was tabled from the June 4th meeting. Consider an approved contract between the Heart of Georgia Ultima Regional Commission and the Wayne County Transit for DHS transportation. Also consider improved agreement between Ware County Board of Health and Wayne County Transit to provide transportation for clients. Consider improved project agreement between the Georgia DOT and the Wayne County on the Robert Hunter Circle Project. Also consider improved resolution for chairman and county clerk to be authorized and directed to execute the agreement for the TIA project, Robert Hunter Circle, and consider approved a beer and wine license on the agenda. Several board appointments, which they tabled last week, again, three for the DFACS board in District 1, 2, and 5. The Terms expired on June 30th, currently serving in those positions in District 1, Jackie Perkins, District 2, Karen Palmer, District 5, Loretta Boykin. Also, a couple of hospital authority appointments on the agenda. Those terms expired June 30th as well. Tim Harrison, District 1, and Ray Thornton, District 2. Again, all five appointments on the agenda for tonight. Also on the agenda, items with county administrator, items with commissioners, executive session. And it all takes place tonight at 7 p.m. I have a full report for you tomorrow here on the local news. County currently advertising for their position of chief appraiser. As a vacancy remains, the former appraiser was terminated by the Board of Assessors. Again, no timetable has been set to fill the position, but it will be the Board of Assessors who handle the hiring of the new appraiser. Salary in the range of seventy dollars to $85,000 per year. The complete job description available from the Human Resources Department. The County Administrator's Office located at 341 East Plum Street. Deadline to apply for the position is July 12th by 5 p.m. Applications are available. Must be submitted to the Human Resources Department at the County Administrator's Office, 341 East Plum Street. In the office hours, Monday through Friday from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. We'll come back with some final news notes after this word from our sponsor, other commercial messages, so please stay tuned. 
folks. Lee Merida, General Manager at Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC in Jessup, home of the No Hassle Deal. We've got some smoking hot deals going on right now through July the 9th. Like 20% off Chevy Cruze, Sonic, Spark, and Impala. Get 19% off on select 1500 series Chevrolet Silverados. Get 11% off all heavy duty Silverados. And get 10% off on all Chevy Suburbans and Tahoes. Amazing. Looking for a GMC? Get 17% off on GMC Terrain Denali's. Get 10% off on GMC Sierra heavy duty trucks. And get 10% off on GMC Yukon and Yukon XL. And if Buick is more your style, we've got Buick Encores for 18% off and 0% financing for 72 months on Buick Enclaves. Wow. Hey, this is Spanky. Nobody sells used cars for less than us here at Neesmith and Jessup. So come on in for your no-hassle deal. New or used, nobody will be our no-hassle deals at Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC. Just up the road in Jessup or online at NeesmithJessup.com. Chevy, find new roads. When you have an accident, you, not the insurance company, chooses the body shop, and you only need one estimate. All you have to do is call Jerome Riles at BNC Collision Center in downtown Scriven to deal with the adjusters and insurance company. Whether it's a little ding or a major crash, that BNC Collision Center across from Wazden Cabinet Shop in Scriven deal with the insurance company so you don't have to. Call them at 579-2274. That's 579-2274. At Country Financial, we're more than just an office you may pass by as you drive through town. We're a part of your community and help support the programs that make our neighborhood thrive. We take the time to get to know our customers. We know that every situation is unique and our goal is to understand yours. So we can help you be confident about your financial security and your future. Call me, Sean O'Quinn, your local Country Financial representative today to talk about how we can help ensure that the future you're dreaming of is something you can proudly own no matter what it looks like. My number is 588 588- 1051. George State Patrol says traffic crashes across Georgia during the July 4th holiday. Travel period resulted in five traffic deaths. The 30 hour holiday period began Tuesday, July 36 and ended Wednesday at 12 midnight. Statewide, Georgia State Troopers investigated 131 traffic crashes, that resulted in 59 injuries. Troopers also investigated two fatal crashes. Fatal crash occurred in Brooks County and Brantley County. In addition to crash investigations, they arrested 118 people for driving under the influence. Jessup Downtown Development Authority Summer Spectacular Promotions underway during this month of July. Lucky winners of the prizes will be announced in August. Participating businesses are offering a spectacular incentive to shoppers this month. Any shopper spends a set of minimum amount in the, in the participating businesses all the way up until July 31st will be entered into the promotion. Four prizes will be given out August the 7th by the DDA. A Jessup gift basket valued at over $400, a $250 gift certificate, $100 and $25 gift certificate. The other prizes, once again, is taking place in the downtown area. Businesses at the participating sponsors throughout the month of July. Waymore Hospital hosting his next blood drive on Monday, July 30th from 11 to 5 p.m. in the blood mobile adjacent to the exterior entrance of the cafe at Waymore Hospital. Appointments can be made by calling 1-800-RED-CROSS or visiting the Red Cross website at redcrossblood.org, entering WMH. When prompted for a sponsor code, walk-ins will be welcome, and all blood types will be needed. Again, the blood drive set for Monday, July 30th from 11 to 5 at the hospital. That's going to do it for latest in local news. Sports comes your way in a few minutes. Bob Morgan said have a great day. You've been listening to local news on WIFO. For all your medical needs, Tim's Home Medical on South First Street in Jessup has you covered. Oxygen, CPAP equipment, wheelchairs, walkers, hospital beds, plus specialty medical equipment from a local company that cares. Tim's Home Medical can handle Medicare, Medicaid, and private insurance billing, as well as family records for tax purposes. Tim's Home Medical, owned and operated by Tim Sloan, 918 South First Street in Jessup. Tim's Home Medical. Call 385-2490, 385-2490. Hi, everyone. We begin our Monday forecast with sunny to partly cloudy skies. Now, we're going to keep that sunshine around, that's for sure. It gets hot quickly. Highs in the upper 80s and low 90s. Tomorrow's sunshine, we're all looking at mid to almost upper 90s. And the same thing on Wednesday. Thursday, sunshine, highs low to mid 90s with a slight chance of a shower or storm in the afternoon. I'm Georgia meteorologist Laura Huckabee in the GNN Weather Center. Do you need a new lawnmower? If so, head to Night Saw Company in Baxley. Choose from a large selection of name brand mowers. 
Knight Saw Company offers the best lawnmowers at the best prices anywhere. They also have in stock belts, batteries, and parts for all mowers, along with name brand trimmers, blowers, and hedge trimmers. For over 50 years, Wayne Countyans have been getting their power lawn equipment and parts from Knight. Knight Saw Company on the Jessup side of Baxley on Highway 341. Summer has arrived, and so have all of the great summer sales. Now's the perfect time to shop downtown Jessup. Take advantage of the Downtown Development Authority Summer Spectacular promotion throughout the month of July. Each time you spend over the minimum amount in a participating merchant, you'll be entered to win one of four great prizes. A downtown gift basket valued at over $1,000, a $250 gift certificate, a $100 gift certificate, or a $50 gift certificate. Winners will be announced on August 7th. Special thank you to our strategic partners, Rainier Advanced Materials, Wayne Memorial Hospital, Jones Medical Equipment, Ottawa Federal Credit Union, Murphy Builder Supply, Williamson Development Company, State Farm, Sinotronics, and Wayne County Chamber of Commerce. Remember to shop local to win one of our four great prizes. Happy shopping! This is Charles Huffman at Jessup Housing Outlet. If you haven't been to Jessup Housing Outlet lately, you're missing out on a large selection of new and exciting floor plans from the nation's top manufacturers like Clayton, Fleetwood, Scottbilt, and Homes of Merit. All of our homes feature modern kitchens and appliances, R60 and higher insulation values, thermopane windows, and energy-efficient heat pumps. We have two locations to serve you, 2452 Savannah Highway in Jessup and Highway 301 South between I-16 and the bypass in Statesboro. Come see Charles... Bay or Sherida today. W-I-F-O-F-M, Big Dog Country. It's time to check your birthdays and anniversaries. Brought to you today by Bartram Power Sports. Happy first birthday today to Walt Anderson. Walt Anderson with lots of love from Uncle John, Aunt Heather, Abby, Aubrey, and Sadie wishing Walt Anderson Happy first birthday to Walt Anderson today. Walt Anderson, one year old. Okay. Happy birthday wishes to Madison Williams. Madison Williams celebrating. Madison Williams today from your Wayne County High School Band family. For Madison Williams from your Wayne County High School Band family. Okay, just looking at this here. uh, This came in after birthdays on Friday. So actually, Walt Anderson was one year old on Friday the 6th. But didn't come in until about uh, 9 o'clock Friday morning. So, best way to get them in is via text at 912 427 3711 while we're uh, doing the birthdays and anniversaries or just before. We'll be happy to get those on for you. Madison Williams, happy birthday from your Wayne County High School band family today. Long County calendar this morning. Kenna Futch is celebrating. Kenna Futch, happy birthday, Kenna Futch. Betty, Betty Wilds, Betty Wilds celebrating as well. Betty Wilds. Carlton Milton on the list. Carlton Milton. So, Kenna Futch, Betty Wilds, and Carlton Milton. Happy birthday. And that is the Long County calendar this morning. All right, nobody in the Big Dog Birthday book, so on to Textosos at 912 427 3711. Happy fourth birthday today to Maddie Kate White. Maddie Kate White is four from Mama, Daddy, Ram, and Josie. Wishing Maddie Kate White happy fourth birthday to Maddie Kate White, four years old today. Yesterday, happy 29th birthday to my baby Caroline Grantham Gay, holding on to her 20s for the last year. I love you, Mama. That is for uh, Caroline Grantham Gay turning uh, 29 yesterday. Happy birthday to our handsome son Garrett settles in heaven we'll be together forever the next time we see you until then we will keep looking up love you mom dad and Madison settles so in memory of Garrett settles today in memory of Garrett settles today I want to wish my mama a happy birthday on Sunday July 8th for mama I don't know who that's from or who mama is but happy birthday mama on Sunday July 8th and then there's uh, some spam there from PayPal. Hello. Happy birthday to Amanda Jones from your daddy. Amanda Jones from your daddy. Happy birthday, Amanda Jones from your daddy today for Amanda Jones. From your daddy today for Amanda Jones from your daddy. 
Happy birthday, belatedly, to Shauna Ray. She was 36 again yesterday. Shauna Ray, 36 again yesterday. I'll trade you. <laughs> you can have mine. I'll take yours. 36 again. Uh, let's see. I don't think that was Mama. I'm trying to do the uh, the uh, detective work to see if there's a number that matches up with who Mama is, but I don't see that there. All right, you've got time to shoot winning right now via text at 912-427-3711. Birthdays and anniversaries on WIFO uh, brought to you uh, by Barger and Power Sports. Here's one. Good morning. We'd like to wish our mother, Kizzy Spearman, a belated happy 65th birthday. That was on Sunday. We love you, your family, for Kizzy Spearman. Kizzy Spearman was 65 yesterday with love from your family for Kizzy Spearman. Famous birthdays today, singer Courtney Love is 54. Entire life I've never wanted a song fully rendered that someone else has written ever. And I went to Linda and I heard Beautiful and it was 11 years old at the time the song was. Composer Earl Hagen was born in 1919. Well now take down your fishing pole and meet me at the vision hole. We may not get a bite all day, but don't you rush away. And singer and actor Ed Ames was born in 1927. Oh, overhand, yeah, overhand drill, the trick is to keep your arm extended and you, know, you keep your arm extended and uh, put only one revolution on the uh, once around, once around uh, on the way. <laughs> That was that Johnny Carson clip that they used to show, remember, when they were trying to sell the CDs or the DVDs where he throws the tomahawk and it ends up in a very sensitive place. Birthdays and anniversaries on WIFO brought to you this morning by Barger and Power Sports. You've got 30 seconds to get one via text at 912-427-3711. We'll come back with your big dog country birthday cake winner right after this. Uh, actually, more wishes for Maddie Kate White. Maddie Kate White 4, that's from... Ashy, Matthew, and Blakely. Maddie Kate White is four years old today. Back with your big dog country birthday cake winner right after this. Bargewood Power Sports invites everyone to come visit their unbelievable new showroom on Highway 301 South in Jessup and on Highway 341 in Brunswick. They have a great selection of ATVs, golf carts, mowers, and more. Bargewood Power Sports carries Arctic Cat four-wheelers and side-by-sides, the new popular Can-Am four-wheelers and side-by-sides, cruise carts, and Yamaha golf carts. Bargewood has the full line of Kimco scooters. Don't forget Bargewood Power Sports on offers a complete service department for all your service and repair needs. Stop by today and check out Bartram Power Sports, Highway 301 South in Jessup, and their new location on Highway 341 next to I-95 in Brunswick. And your big dog country birthday cake winner on this Monday morning, Maddie Kate White, is four years old and picks up the cake from the Jessup Piggly Wiggly Bakery. That certificate's here at the station. Come by, pick that up. It's good for today only. Head to the pig and claim your prize. Barge and Power Sports, Brunswick Jessup Online, bargeandpowersports.com. Uh, brings you the birthdays and anniversaries. We're wishing Matty Kate White happy fourth birthday, the Big Dog Country Birthday Cake winner. Well, thank you for waking up at WIFO at 731. Let's see, there's another birthday here. Happy birthday to Like M. Ready. Is that Mike McCready, maybe, from Mama and Daddy with Love? Autocorrect is a strange and wonderful thing. Happy birthday. Matty Kate White, four years old, picks up the cake from the Jessup Piggly Wiggly Bakery. Since 1946, Murphy's Builder Supply has been serving the folks of Jessup, Wayne, and surrounding counties with quality products and knowledgeable service. Matter of fact, they feel they sell service first to make sure you get exactly what you need for your home improvement projects. And with each employee at Murphy's being there for 10 years or more, you know you're talking with someone with the experience to help you with building supplies, tools, paint, and all the things you need from a full-service hardware store. The best choice in home improvement is Murphy's Builder Supply, 156 Northeast Broad Street, Jessup. Check out these money-saving specials at your Jessup Piggly Wiggly. Fresh lean ground chuck, two eighty eight a pound. Quarter lawn pork chops, one thirty eight a pound. Fresh green peanuts, only a dollar twenty eight a pound. And large seeded or seedless watermelons, three ninety eight each. 
Piggly Wiggly has boneless ribeye steaks for six ninety eight a pound and center cut pork chops a low dollar ninety eight a pound. Go online to thepig.net for all of the pig specials. Piggly Wiggly, West Cherry Street in Jessup. Seven thirty three here at WIFOFM Big Dog Country Still to Come State News from GNM. We'll check in with Bob Morgan Sports Braves. Went five and five on that tough road trip. Uh, Philly lost yesterday, so like a percentage point, one percentage point difference as they're tied for first. Phillies will play to get today, so there'll be a half game swing as the Braves have an off day. Let's get a look at that. Uh, okay, correction and retraction time here. That's Luke McCready. Luke McCready is the birthday that we had that the autocorrect kind of messed up there. Luke McCready. Happy birthday wishes today to Luke McCready. All right, GNN Weather Center forecast on WIFO. Hi, everyone. We begin our Monday forecast with sunny to partly cloudy skies. Now, we're going to keep that sunshine around, that's for sure. It gets hot quickly. Highs in the upper 80s and low 90s. Tomorrow's sunshine, we're all looking at mid to almost upper 90s. And the same thing on Wednesday. Thursday, sunshine. Highs low to mid 90s with a slight chance of a shower or storm in the afternoon. I'm Georgia meteorologist Laura Huckabee in the GNN Weather Center. River level 8.2. That is uh, slowly fading, slowly clear on the river, 8.2 point two and falling. We've got a low tide this morning at eleven twenty six. High this afternoon five thirty two. Seven point five feet. Sunset at eight thirty five. Temperatures in the mid to upper as we're going um, as the sun comes up seventy four here at WIFO FM Big Dog Country. Your GNN Weather Center forecast at seven thirty four. Let's get a look at state news from GNN. That's brought to you this morning by England's Mobile Glass and England's Collision Center. Ah! England's Collision Center Mobile Glass. You know a good feeling is when you pick up your car satisfied. England's Collision Center and Mobile Glass. Serving our community for over 20 years for all your collision and windshield needs. England's Collision Center, located at 586 Southwest Broad Street. 912-588-9922. I'm John Jeffries with the Georgia News Network. Three Jackson County women are under investigation for allegedly filming a Snapchat video they titled The End in the Room of a Stroke Patient. The suspects worked at a senior living facility and were supposed to be watching the 76-year-old woman while waiting for a hospice nurse. Another employee saw the video they filmed in the patient's room. The women now face charges of exploiting an elderly and disabled person. One man is in jail for allegedly killing a woman he met at the Rainbow Family Gathering outside Dahlonega last week. Police in Kentucky told the Lumpkin County Sheriff's Office that the suspect was arrested there. The two reportedly met while they were hitchhiking after the event was over. The group of self-proclaimed nature lovers have been meeting for nearly a half century. And last week's gathering was the first ever in Georgia. If you've noticed what seems like an abnormal amount of rain lately, you're not alone. University of Georgia climatologist Pam Knox says the first six months of...